All right, heading on the trail. This is the AT. There's the creek. We're headed back to uh, Long Creek Falls. And uh, most of the trail is like this, back to the split with the BMT. So it's going to be fairly benign double track along this creek side here. Parking lot's just right behind me. It's where Three Forks AT dumps out from Springer Mountain, crosses the forest road, and comes straight on here. So, spent the day driving the Jeep around on the roads and uh, do some creek crossings and stuff, and then thought I'd come up here and walk back to uh, Long Creek. I don't see a lot of ice forming down there. It's been some on the side of the road, but must have warmed up. I have no idea what the temperature is, but probably about 35, give or take, maybe. Rhododendrons are all sagging and curled a little bit. They say the, the more curled the leaves, the colder it was. So these don't look actually terribly bad. Well, those do. Of course, that got hit with a tree. But uh, not terribly bad. I've seen them curled, curled under before and kind of makes sense. But uh, yeah, most of the trail should be like this. Let's see what the falls look like. When I did the AT section here, I didn't go out to the falls. I just it was kind of rainy and drizzly. You can go see that video on YouTube. Uh, I just wanted to get this section knocked out and didn't bother, so. It's not like it's going anywhere. I could always come back, so I'm back. I'm back! <laughs> All right, Long Creek Falls. Some ice. real slippery here on the roots you have to really watch it you could step on something dark and you'd, you'd be down with a bad leg Okay, so Long Creek Falls is really just eighth of a mile or so. You gotta make sure you wanna make this turn when you come up, you'll be coming from this way if you could come do this trail. Benton Mackay goes that way, AT goes that way, Long Creek goes that way. And this'll be where I go, the Duncan Ridge Benton Mackay Trail. Uh, so yeah, that kind of looked like it went to the falls, but it doesn't, it goes back, so. That'll be my turn right there behind me when I go to start the BMT. So, anyway, when you come up this way, just remember, falls are to the left. Should be cool. So on this hike between Long Creek and uh, Three Forks, this is about the widest thing you're gonna have to cross. You can see it's still cold. There's ice, you can see it shimmering in there and see it formed here on the side. And even going on down the, down the creek bed. Goes down, spills off into the, the creek down there. They all kind of merge up at Three Forks, make their way down beside the forest road. Lots of good camping down through there if you want a car camp down on that forest road, going back to Three Forks down and north, uh, or I guess it'd be east and west. 
but uh yeah plenty of plenty of camping there you are another little creek just just a wee little bit of ice down here on that one and lots of big trees Now this is three forks. Beautiful. Got a tenter over here, probably a through hiker. I don't know. I've already seen three through hikers. Just past one. Uh, answered a few questions about this section as they make their way up to uh, Hawk Mountain Shelter. That's probably where they end up. So it's like at least they'll have some company. It's going to get cold tonight. Sleet, snow. I think up here, if they're really lucky, it won't be any freezing rain. Hopefully this high up, they'll just get some, some snow or sleet. Cold, but I'd rather have that than, you know, cold rain, so. Hopefully they stay warm. Get in the Jeep and guess what, mate? 